How's it going, everybody, and welcome back to D Squared Fishing. Oh. <laughs> I'm David. Yes, this video is a little bit different. Uh, today, I am talking to you specifically about fishing and sun safety. Yes, <sighs> since I was diagnosed with melanoma, uh, you got to be you got to be safe out there. I mean, you youngsters, you kids, even you know you older gentlemen and ladies, you know. You gotta be sun smart, right? You don't want to go out there and get burnt every day because that is technically not gonna be a good thing in the long run. Damage your skin. I mean, yes, melanoma is a rare cancer, um, but you know, you just got you just gotta be very sun smart. So today, I just want to show you, you know, some things fishermen, anglers, you know, can use to you know to not get burnt. And you know, and I been fishing. Haven't caught nothing. January, I think, let's see, I caught something in January ever since that last video. Uh, it says February 17th. Caught nothing. Been fishing every weekend. And I was like, well, I got to put something out there for y'all. So, you know, I was thinking, you know, sun safety now is very dear to my heart with, you know, my situation. So, so this was, you know, like I said, a little different video. So, first things first, when you're going fishing, <clears throat> sunny day out, even non-sunny day out, you know, number one go-to I get a little sunblock, a sunscreen. Me, I do not like sunscreen. I don't like the way it feels. It's like a weird pet peeve thing of mine. I just, ugh, it just cringes just feeling that, you know, greasy. Ugh. But anyway, definitely, you know, that's all <coughs> personal preference. You got some, you know, that spray stuff, sunscreen, just get you something good. High, uh, you know, SPF, I think that's what, the, yeah, SPF. High SPF, I think they say 30. And, you know, is you know adequate, you know enough. But if you can get, I mean, a hundred percent is what I like. <laughs> but you know, that's just me. But anyway, sunscreen. Now, another thing, of course, a good hat. You know, you can use a good hat, a uh, good brim with you know a gator. Um, you know, you put that around your face. You put it around your face, around your ears, protects your neck. You know, you have you know adequate shade from the sun that is one good option or you know here's some other gators uh you know different colors they come in a, you know different variety of colors these are just the ones i own or you can get yourself a nice little bucket hat you know a bucket hat wide brim and, you know it covers you all areas you still i recommend using a gator cover up a little bit and you know from the sun from hitting you on these directions but of course good hat you know whatever you choose preference wise you know just protect you know, your ears, your face, sunscreen on it or something. You know, something good. Now, shirt, uh, well, let's, uh, let's go with gloves. Since I'm wearing gloves. Finally got me some fishing gloves. Uh, I went with this company called Fish Monkey. Honestly, the reason why I went with Fish Monkey, I just thought the name was funny. <laughs> Sorry. I looked them up. They got good reviews. Um, I, I like, you know, the way I never heard of them before, but the name just made me laugh. Okay. So I went with them. I know there's other brands out there, reputable brands, but Fish Monkey, I thought that was hilarious. I know it's childish for me, but whatever. You know, that's just just the way I am. Now, connected to the Fish Monkey, uh, fishing shirts. Um, you know, this one's a hook. Uh, you know, you got Columbia, you got Under Armour, you got a bunch of brands out there, you know, you know, uh, SPF or UPF or whatever it's called um, on the shirt. You know, if you look for 50 or, you know, around that. Good, nice shirt, breathable. You're not too hot in it. Keeps you, you know, keeps your skin shaded. Everything's good. Really like, uh, you know, these types of shirts. The 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 feeling of them is just, I don't know. I mean, the brand, you know, this is, the, you know, it's Hook. And when I get these types of shirts, um, like Hook Columbia, you know, Under Armour, I rarely pay full price. I always wait until they're on sale. This one right here got kind of twenty bucks. I mean, yeah, it's still kind of pricey. But 20 bucks is better compared to, I think it was like, they're what, normally 35, something like that. So, it's not bad, not bad. You keep an eye out on these sales, you can get them pretty decent price. Now, uh, pants. I got these Columbia pants, fishing pants. Uh, you know, almost kind of, well, they're, they're somewhat, no, I don't know. But anyway, they're, they're, they're fishing, uh, I think they're called like blood and guts or whatever. Um, but anyway, once again, I didn't get these at full price. These are breathable pants. I mean, you can wear jeans, you know, whatnot, shorts, if you, you know, put your sunscreen on there. Um, 
these uh, khaki light pants. Like, yeah, I think I got them for like, it was around like 20 bucks too. They, they had some type of sale on um, the Columbia website. Snatched them up. Once again, I never pay, I try not to pay full price on anything without, um, you know, I don't know. It's really hard for me to pay full price. I don't know. I just, I just can't do it. I just can't do it. I just can't do it. But anyway, once again, with the shirts in mind, uh, they got uh, shirts here. I really like these. I think I'm going to start wearing these more because the collar. I like the collar. You know, this one right here, uh, Magellan, I got this from uh, Academy Sports. You know, and then Field and Stream is Dick's. Uh, you know, they got their own brand names out there. This one, once again, got it for 20 bucks because it was on sale. And, you know, the, it has this back in here, this air vent here, air get up in there. Uh, I think it was SPF on this 30, 40. I don't know. But anyway, once again, it, you know, looks nice, presentable. You can roll your sleeves up. You know, if you get too hot, you know, whatnot, slide up some sunscreen on there if you don't want it. But, you know, these shirts are good too. I really like them. like them a lot. And then, of course, last but not least, <clears throat> this goes along with the whole face area with your with your uh, gator and your hat and all that. You gotta get you some cool shades, man. And these, once again, spare no expense. Got these off Zenny. Uh, the prescription, uh, I think I spent, I wanna say 25 bucks. I mean, you can't go wrong, 25 bucks on some prescription sunglasses. But anyway, put them on, boom, eyes protected. Boom, get your gator here, you figure out how to put it on, put it around your head, like this, you slap it on there like that. There you go. See, you got it in there. I don't know, you guys have problems uh, when you're wearing a gator, you get starting to get all foggy up in here, you know what I mean? Start, <laughs> starting to get all foggy in those glasses. Uh, I, I don't know, that's just something you gotta deal with. I'm sure I'll probably figure it out later, but you know, if the wind's blowing, it usually doesn't do it if the wind's blowing. But anyway. So, this is just in a nutshell, some options of what you can wear uh, fishing-wise, clothing-wise. Uh, there's tons of brands out there, um, so you can't go wrong, you know. Be sun smart, you know. Protect yourself. Yes, you know, you go out there and you're like, eh, I'm only going to be out there an hour or two. You never know, man. That sunburn, it, it, it's sunburn. I just don't like sunburn, man. Sunburn's bad. But anyway. <laughs> Hope you all like this. This is just, you know, just a little video of like what you can wear. Um, and and once again, if you just pay attention online, they got a lot of flash sales. They got a lot of, you know, discount promos. Just go out there and you can, I'm sure you can find, you know, even brand name, like I said. I only spent like 20 bucks on this thing. Yeah, I'm sure you can probably get it cheaper somewhere else. Um, but there's tons of brands out there. If You know, you don't want to stick with brand names. There's off brands out there that are cheap. And then, of course, if you don't, you know, want to spend the money on clothing, if you're willing to slather on that good old sunscreen. Uh, Brand-wise, I don't have a brand. Uh, I just grabbed this. This is old. And I, you know, try to cover up the brand. You know, I don't want to, you know, go on Walmart. But, I mean, no, <laughs> just uh, But no, seriously, sunscreen. Um, anything just to protect yourself from the sun. Be sun smart. Right? Yeah. <laughs> But anyway, I hope you all like this little video. I just wanted to give you something. Um, I think I'm going to start doing a lot of reviews and whatnot. I think I want to review these. These these are pretty cool. I like these. Uh, I didn't think. These don't seem too, you know, big and clunky. You know, so I really like these gloves so far. You know, I wore them driving around just to, you know, just kind of. So I haven't got the fish in them yet. But I, got, I really like this company. I mean, the monkey on it, man. Check out the monkey. He's talking. <laughs> but anyway, seriously. Hope you all like this video. Go ahead and hit that like smash that subscribe and uh, I'll talk to you later on the next episode of Discord Fishing. Hopefully I'll be fishing. Today's rainy and it's boring and bummed out and ain't catching no fish. Winter time's no fun. But anyway, catch y'all later. Thank you for watching. See you later.